Hello, welcome to day 80 of the vlog. So, I've decided to try something uh, a little bit different for the next, I don't know, couple days, maybe a couple weeks. We'll see how it goes. Um, a bit of a, a format for these vlogs, make a touch more predictable, and um, really help them be what I want them to be at the start, which is sort of a a daily reminder to continue pushing forward with some goals, right? Setting goals, achieving goals, moving forward. So. What I've decided to do is to sort of break the vlogs up into three parts. The first is a review of yesterday. What happened yesterday? What did I do? Did I accomplish what I wanted to do or did I not? Did I have some tr trouble with it? And then set goals for today, as it is the morning, so I can set some goals for today. And the last, just a general thought of the day. That'll be sort of kind of what you what would you hear from me um, on some of my long-winded random thoughts about politics, what, whatever. And so I'm, I think I'm going to try to break the videos up into those three segments and just see how it goes. You guys, please leave your feedback uh, and let me know what you think about this. And yeah, we'll just give it a try for a little while and see what happens. Okay, so in that spirit, review of yesterday. Yesterday I was trying really hard to get some photos off of my Nokia phone and so far none of the things have worked. Thank you so much for those of you who have sent me ideas on how to get it. Um, I have not been able to do that yet. I think I may have to go see if I can purchase a small um, SD card for the phone um, because the SIM card, the, the card that's in it doesn't doesn't work. It's not registering. It's an AT&T card. I don't know. It's, it's crazy. The photo, the videos are saved to the phone itself and I can't seem to get them off. I need to find somebody who has a Microsoft computer. Um, unfortunately, I work with people who pretty much all have Apple computers so it is a bit tricky. Um, I'll keep trying and hopefully I can get that done. Additionally, yesterday I was trying to really get back into the swing of the, the diet and, and getting back into that and I was an epic failure on my part. It did not go well yesterday. Apparently, I'm just, you know, it's, a, it's harder than I thought to get back into it after taking some a few days off for vacation and really enjoying that time and not worrying about all of that. Um, and now I'm just, okay, I'm struggling to get back into it, but that's that's okay. That's okay. Well, we're going to get back into it. It's going to be great. Um, <clears throat> yesterday evening, I went and played at an open mic in Dallas. It was a lot of fun. A place called The Opening Bell. It was an absolute blast. I love performing. I really, truly do, and I feel like I've been getting better. If you haven't seen the video, it's on my Facebook page and Facebook Live. Um, and one of my students sang as well. Her name is Dharma, incredibly talented uh, young lady. So you can check her out as well. She's fantastic. Um, so yeah, that was yesterday. It was a lot of fun. It was uh, it was a good evening. I really enjoyed getting to, to do that. Um, the goals for today are try to get back on this uh, on the the diet plan. Try to get back on it. Um, I've started off today better. I actually planned out, had a good breakfast. Um, have a better idea of what I'm eating today and a plan for how I'm going to sort of accomplish what I want to with that. So we'll see how that goes. I'm still not exercising like I want to um, and I'm going to try to remedy that this week. There, I'm going to be hopefully picking up this big tire from this guy. I met a guy who uh, can hook me up with a tire for free. It's just a, like a big tractor tire that I can use for some of the workouts that I've been wanting to do. And when I get that, I will share with you what I'm going to try to do with said tire. You guys can let me know if it's ridiculous or not. That is up to you. But the goals for today is to just try to get back on it. Try to get back on the, the diet thing. Be, be smarter about it. Be more committed to it. And sort of push through that uh, temptation to just blow it off completely. Um, Got to get back on that. So that's really the primary goal for today. Um, is just to do that. So we'll see how that goes. Um, see how that goes. I'll, I'll let you know tomorrow uh, if today was was really better throughout the entire day, or if I just started well and then completely fell off the bandwagon. Um, and then a final thought for the day. Okay. And this is this is a bit about politics. Uh, it's not going to be too crazy, but the political coverage right now is so ridiculous that I think it's actually it's actually having a numbing effect on people. I don't watch the news. I don't even pay attention most of the time to what's going on. The trending topics on Twitter are such political hit jobs all the way around. Um, everything is just so extreme and crazy and the accusations are endless and you know, you can you can say whatever you want about anybody and then you're just like, you know what, I, I don't care anymore about all of the rest of this because we're just randomly throwing out accusations. We're just throwing stuff out there. I mean, 
we're continuing to beat the same stories that have no more, like, that haven't materialized any actual evidence. And it's just like, I can't do it anymore. I, so I've stopped paying attention to the news coverage of almost everything having to do with politics because it's so much of it is just insane, bad journalism. It's people just playing politics for ratings. I don't think journalists are even journalists anymore for the large part. They're just people chasing ratings. They're just any other television talk show host chasing ratings by saying what they think people want to hear, get people to tune in, scare people or freak people out or, or play one side against the other. That's all it is. That's all it is. So I'm just done with it. I'm over it. Um, let me know what you what you think about these, about, about the news and how it's being covered right now. Um, are you still tuned in really heavily? Because I'm just not. I don't feel like you're actually getting a good representation of what's going on. I feel like you're just getting thrown a bunch of politics. And in order to really figure out the truth, you have to do so much crazy digging. And even then, you're not even you're not even sure you're going to find the truth. Because it's like every single news source has just turned in to a talking piece for one political ideology or another. No one's just reporting, hey, here's what happened. Make up your mind. It's not happening anymore. And that's frustrating. It is frustrating. So just a thought. Please let me know what you think about that. You agree? Disagree? You think the coverage has been fantastic? You think it's been ridiculous? Let me know. Let me know. Okay, so there's the first video with this uh, this new format. Uh, what do you guys think about it? Do you like it? Does it uh, make sense? Um, like I said, I'm going to keep doing it for a few days and just see how it goes, um, see if it works as sort of a motivating factor for me to continue really being committed to some of the things that I wanted to do this year. Um, so we'll see, we'll see what happens. But yeah, let me know. Leave a comment. And as always, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys tomorrow.